to see if you're going to still give him praise. And I realize, woman of God, it's always people the closest to you that it's always the people closest to you that the enemy always get into. Come on here, somebody. But, 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 but because it's so close home, God wants to see if you would really give me glory even in the situation. So the Bible says that trial produces you got rings on your finger that diamond looks good but somebody had to go into the gold mine somebody had to go in the earth somebody had to do the dirty work for you to have the glory on your finger you already talking to me amen somebody had to dig through dirt man of god and diamonds don't come out looking like diamonds they look like glass they look dirty but after it's been Oh, help the Holy Ghost. There, there, there is a young lady now getting married and carried this hunk of gold to the blacksmith and designed her ring the way she wanted it. She was so excited. Natalie, she went week one and said, is it done yet? He said, no, hey, I'm just still working. On your ring. She came week two and said, Well, by now you must at least can show me something. He said, Now I'm still working on your ring. One whole month gone by. She said, By now, look, Joker, I need my ring. This time she saw him putting it in the fire, taking it out. Blowing on it, rubbing it, putting it back in the fire, taking it out, blowing on it. And she looked at him and said, what are you doing? He says, your ring is not finished yet. She said, well, the diamonds are in it and the ring looks good to me. She said, says, no, 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 no. I'm going to help somebody in here. He says, so she said, well, sir. How will I know that my ring is finished? Jesus. He says, when I shine it and I can see my reflection. Yeah. Some of you say, God, when am I going to go through my challenge and, I, and I'm going to be over this? God says, until I can see my reflection in your child. I'm not talking to somebody in here. Yes, Lord. Why am I still going through? Because God is saying, I still need to see my reflection. Y'all ain't talking to me. You're in the storm because God still wants you to give him glory. You're in the fire because God wants to see you praising him. In the midst of people talking about you. When they say you can't, you're not going to cuss but you're going to praise. Come on. When they say you won't, you're not going to lose your mind, but you're going to go in a worship. Uh, somebody say yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Uh, some of you are still going through what you're going through. Uh, because God says, I want to see my reflection uh, in you, Lord of his mercy. Uh, in uh, the storm, sister Shy. Uh, the more you're going through is the more God becomes real. Uh, is the more God becomes more visible. Uh, and I come to tell somebody, if you want to get closer to God, uh, that the fire is going to be your best friend uh, if you want to be purified uh, if you want God to elevate you to the next level Deacon Jerome uh, you got to learn to take licks and keep on ticking uh, you got to learn uh, to make people talk about you uh, and you not lose your mind uh, not lose your cool uh, not go crazy because of the story oh God I'm helping somebody in here uh, and Daniel said, Lord, whatever it takes uh, for my glory to be revealed, uh, I am not going to bow. Uh, somebody say, yes, Lord. Uh, yes, Lord. Here it is now. The text is in the text. Uh, Daniel.
Daniel, 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 what are you going to do now? Now that everybody is talking about you and they say that you are not going to come out of this. Let me skip over in the book of Acts by the name of Paul and Silas. And they were in jail, man of God. And after they were whipped and beaten, something got into Mr. Peter and Peter and Paul and they all came together Paul and Silas they said well 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 I know we're bleeding I know that they talked about us I know that they whipped us but I know what can get me out of here if you're crazy enough to hook up with me in a praise break in the midst of your challenge in the midst of your pain I'm going to somebody in here that feel as though you're not going to make it. I come to prophesy to you. Make up in your mind that I'm not going to play dead. But the reflection of God has to be seen in me. So while I sit here for a few moments, I decide to have a praise break. I decide to give God some glory. I'm not going to lose my mind because of what I'm going through. I'm going to need my mind uh, to decorate the new house uh, that I'm going to get. Uh, I'm not going to lose my mind uh, because of the man that walked out on me. Uh, I'm getting ready uh, to be a bride. Uh, you're going to need your mind. Uh, you're going to need your mind. Uh, the Bible said uh, that I would prepare uh, a table before you uh, in the presence of your enemy. Uh, you're going to need your mind uh, to come to the back where your enemy shall see it Rejoice again and again Somebody say yes Lord Look at your neighbor, say neighbor Don't lose your mind Don't lose your mind Don't break down Don't break down Before you break through Is there anybody in here? Say neighbor, don't break down Don't break down Don't break down It's time to break down I'm not gonna have a nervous breakdown, a mental disorder, but I'm getting ready to have on the mind of Christ. I'm getting ready to give God some glory. I'm getting out of here. I'm gonna come back tomorrow night. But while I leave you with this word, look at your neighbor. Say, neighbor, if you survive the night, if you can survive the nightmare, if you can survive the one o'clock, the twelve o'clock, the three o'clock, if you can survive, if you can survive, if you can stay alive, if you can give them glory in your prison, if you can give them glory in your dungeon. Bye.